Let's write the balanced net ionic equation for ammonium sulfate plus barium hydroxide. The first thing we need to do with net ionic equations, we have to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. I can see I have two ammonium ions here and only one here. So I'm going to put a two in front of the ammonium hydroxide. So now I have the two ammonium ions on both sides. I also have two hydroxide ions, two here. So that's good. Barium, barium, and then we have a sulfate ion on each side as well. So that's the balanced molecular equation. Now we need to write the state for each substance. That looks like this. So compounds with the ammonium ion are very soluble. So these two substances are soluble. And we'll split them apart into their ions. And barium hydroxide, barium hydroxide is considered a strong base. So that's going to be considered aqueous here as well. Barium sulfate, in general, sulfates are soluble, but barium sulfate, that's kind of one of the exceptions. It's insoluble, so it's going to be a solid. These substances, they react. We get this solid here, falls to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate. So we have our states. Next, we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. And in ionic equations, we don't split apart solids, so we're going to leave the barium sulfate together. That'll look like this. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. So in the reactants, I see I have two of these ammonium ions. I also have two ammonium ions here in the products. Those are spectator ions. We'll cross those out. I see that we have two hydroxide ions here in the reactants. Again, in the products, spectator ions, cross them out. But what's left, that's the net ionic equation for ammonium sulfate plus barium hydroxide. I'll clean it up, write the states, we'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation. Note that charge is conserved. We have a 2 plus and a 2 minus. They balance to give us a net charge of 0. Barium sulfate neutral compound net charge of 0 in the products. Charge is conserved. And if you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for NH42SO4 plus BaOH2. Ammonium sulfate plus barium hydroxide. Thanks for watching.